when I talked about the business requirements that a business has to deal with, you really do need an HS code to derive the duty rate of an item. And it can vary by country and by product. And HS codes and duty rates are extremely complex for businesses to understand and manage on their own. And it's difficult to get an ROI when you're paying for a classification service. Since e-commerce orders typically comprise of a variety of different line items on international orders, I mean, it, it, so it can get really costly to try to uh, classify these items on your own. So let me give you an example. So look at this cart, have in here a rucksack, a tent, and a beanie. And as you take a closer look at the rucksack, what we've done in the past and really been building out over the past, uh, over the past year is the ability to find the right keywords through natural language processing of what's in the cart. So in this case, you know, well, we can determine possibly from the description sack, keywords like nylon, water bottle, straps. But it's, it's, it, it's still missing some information, right? But as they say, you know, photos don't lie. So today we are announcing that we are adding product image recognition to determine and classify the item dynamically at during the shopping experience. So now let's take a look at this example. It's a rucksack, which is a, you know, a clever description, like a lot of online uh, goods do have a clever description. For customs, when it's clearing, it's a backpack. And this is a nylon backpack. So this is what we're announcing today will be known as Zonos Classify. It's going to be a classification machine. And Zonos Classify is patent pending. Our beta version for six digit classification is available on March 1st for all Zonos checkout customers at no additional cost for their first 10,000 SKUs. And we anticipate classification to the eighth and 10th digit for many of the top export destinations by the fall of this year. 